Hi, now we are going to discuss about the causes, only causes for all the four metabolic, that is acid-base balance disorders. First one is metabolic acidosis, very very simple routine causes are diabetic ketoacidosis, lactic acidosis, these two first. Second, two kidney conditions. One is renal failure, chronic renal failure. Second one is renal tubular acidosis. Renal tubular acidosis <coughs> due to loss of bicarbonate ions. And then one more additional condition is severe diarrhea. Diarrhea also removes all the bicarbonates, right? This is for metabolic acidosis. Coming to the respiratory acidosis, fully diseases, respiratory diseases, that is COPD, chronic obstructive pulmonary diseases, asthma, pneumonia, uh, emphysema, like that. Then respiratory muscle related two conditions. One is poliomyelitis, another one is multiple sclerosis. Next one is drug related respiratory acidosis, morphine. This morphine depresses the respiratory center and they will go for respiratory acidosis. This morphine is very, very important. Next, coming to metabolic alkalosis. In this alkalosis, the gastric contents will get removed by gastric lavage or loss of gastric juice, nasogastric drainage like that. Okay? And vomiting also removes all the contents that leads to respiratory alkalosis. Second one is some patients, peptic ulcer patients for therapeutic administration, they are using some alkali. This alkali also produces respiratory, sorry, metabolic alkalosis. Okay. The last one is respiratory alkalosis, right? Respiratory alkalosis means 5H. The mnemonic is 5H. Hyperpyrexia, high altitudes, hysteria, hypoxia, heart failure like that. That is hyperventilation, hysteria, anxiety, fever, hyperpyrexia, high altitudes, hypoxia, working at high temperature also leads to respiratory alkalosis. So these are all the causes for four acid-base imbalances for your university examination. So, you should read the question carefully, either acidosis or alkalosis, either metabolic or respiratory. If metabolic means, the commonest question is metabolic acidosis. If respiratory is, the commonest question is respiratory alkalosis. So, you should read about the question carefully for your university.